10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. There, 22 steps to selling the 1966 Mercury. And selling it is just what I intend to do to you. First of all, let's consider styling. Here's what has happened. Overall, it's easy to see the resemblance to the 1965 Mercury. The few exterior changes we've made are still in keeping with the classic look of Lincoln Continental. They're most obvious in the grill. As you can see, there are new parking lamps. The tail lamps are new, and certain ornamental areas are changed. The leading edge of the front fenders have been rounded and tapered. If the car seems longer somehow, chalk it up to an overall increase of two full inches. So to sum up styling, your new Mercury is a longer, sleeker version of last year's styling pace setter. On the outside, that is. Inside, there's a whale of a difference between 65 and 66. And I don't mean just in interiors. They're just what they should be with increased elegance in each series, from Monterey to Montclair to Park Lane. But you'd expect that. The big surprises in 66 start when you turn the ignition key. Big news, 15 more horses for a total of 265 on a new improved 390 two barrel engine. Standard on Monterey, Montclair, commuter and colony park wagons. For buyers who order the multi-drive Mercomatic, horsepower will be up to 275 in 66. The second big piece of performance news is Mercury's new and exclusive 410-inch four-barrel engine that whips up 330 big ones. Your new 410 is standard on Park Lane and available optionally on all other series. For performance-minded buyers, Mercury offers a new special optional 428-inch four-barrel engine that delivers a sizzling 345 horsepower. This engine, too, is available on all 1966 Mercuries. To see that your customers get the most from your 410-inch or 428-inch new engines, Mercury has developed a special new dual-range transmission for quicker, smoother acceleration and most efficient use of power. Along with all this performance, you'll be able to offer a mighty important option it's Mercury's new competition-developed front disc brakes for sure stops under any driving conditions. That's another Mercury Plus this year. More of the kind of options medium-priced buyers are demanding to express their personal taste. There's a very impressive list of new ones. First, do you dig Beethoven or Brubeck? Take your choice with a stereo tape player that takes you inside the concert hall. There's a new six-way power bucket seat, a power window bypass switch so you can operate windows without the key. Cornering lights light your way through the turn. Now, let's talk about model lineup. You'll have 17 in all, including a new two-door hardtop available in all series. Here's the full lineup. Monterey offers six stylish choices. Two-door, 
and four-door sedans, a four-door breezeway sedan, a four-door hardtop, the new two-door hardtop, plus, of course, that big value convertible. The middle series, Montclair, with a four-door sedan and two and four-door hardtops. The Prestige Park Lane series offers a four-door breezeway sedan, two and four-door hardtops, and a luxurious convertible. And of course, Mercury's two great station wagon, the all-metal commuter, and the elegant Colony Park are back with us for 66. Back, I might add, with a swinging new tailgate, lifted in the conventional way. Swing it from the side. That's Mercury's new dual hinge tailgate for improved third seat access and easier loading. Now here's something else about this year's line. To help you merchandise Mercury's growing performance image, the special designation S55 is back this year as a fourth new series offering a convertible and that new two-door hardtop. The special S55 will feature that red-hot 428-inch engine and a choice of the new dual-range transmission, or four on the floor. To complete the high-performance package, your S55 will have deluxe wheel covers and steering wheel. And of course, bucket seats and console. You know, your 1965 Mercury established instant acclaim as a fine road handling automobile. Well, let me assure you, the 66 Mercury improves even on last year's fine ride. The road handling qualities, if possible, are even better, while the soft cushioned ride has been preserved. Make sure every prospect has the opportunity to sell himself that your 66 Mercury excels in every riding characteristic. It's the best ride on the market this side of Continental. Mercury, bigger, better, more beautiful than ever in 1966. Move ahead with Mercury, way ahead. Mercury. 